Is it giving or is it giving bitch what the fuck? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're gonna be doing a get ready with me, a full get ready with me. These are always fun. So I'm gonna go ahead and get started with my hair. I already installed this wig this morning. So I'm just gonna go ahead and straighten it. This wig is from Amazon. I will link it down below and leave all the details and stuff. This is my first time wearing it. So I don't really have much thoughts on it. I literally, just put it on but i have bought other wigs from this brand this particular brand on amazon and i do like it so like i said i will leave everything down below but i am just gonna go ahead and straighten it with my babyless straightener flat iron what <laughs> and we can just speed through this real quick <laughs> anyway so let's start with the face I'm gonna prime so Charlotte Tilbury airbrush flawless setting spray all right and I'm going to take my NYX bear with me brow setter I use this to comb out my brow hairs. My face is still a little too wet to do this, but I really need to get my brows waxed, like real bad. But like, tell me if y'all are like this. If I go to set up an appointment for something like this, or just, yeah, to go set up an appointment and the person isn't available for like, in, until three weeks from now, I don't want it. I want the shit now. Are y'all like that? And it's like, okay, but book the appointment. But no, I just don't book the appointment. I don't know why I be getting upset like that. Like, I, I want the appointment now. I want the appointment for this week. I don't know why that upsets me. Like I've gone onto the person's page three times and I'm like, oh, I can't book it for three weeks from now. Nothing's gonna change when you come back next week, Aaron you're still not gonna be able to book it. They're busy. Book it now. No, for some reason I'm upset that I can't get it this week and I just keep not booking it. I'm dumb, <laughs> clearly. I'm gonna use my e.l.f. brow pomade because the next brow pencil is like hitting but it's not hitting for me right now. So, I'm not gonna use that. With my um, Anastasia Beverly Hills brow pencil. I need a handheld mirror, like a specific mirror for this job. My brows don't look good today. And that's, that's okay. <laughs> All right, for eyes, I'm going to prep them with the e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer. You guys, I like, do you guys listen to music when you get ready or do you watch a show or like YouTube or something? 
What do you prefer when you're getting ready? Or does it depend on the vibe? Like if you're getting ready for work, do you prefer one thing versus like if you're getting ready to go out? I personally, I'm always gonna watch a show or something because I don't listen to music that often. And I, I never, I rarely listen to music in my own house. Music is for the car. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna take the Jaclyn Hill palette because I'm feeling very pink today. Um, and I'm going to take the color hmm, Dance Party. I'm gonna start by putting that into the crease. not the right brush for this but we're gonna make it work it's just too dense all right now I'm going to take something more fluffy and I'm just gonna blend that out a little bit because like I said that brush was this is green have green on it my favorite method of trying to see if a dirty brush still has that product on it is rubbing it down my arm <laughs> um, and that's how I clean my brushes highly recommend um, so I'm just gonna take a more fluffy brush and kind of blend it out a little bit because like I said that first brush was a little dense this is a rusty movie and this brush is tinted green I could have I fucked up the whole eye there. And I did it anyway, because I, I don't care. Um, and now that we are successfully really, really pink, I don't know what I'm doing next. <laughs> I didn't really think this through. I just knew I wanted to wear pink eyeshadow. I'm gonna take another pink, what about this one? Mm. It's going bold. Okay, I'm gonna take a purple instead. I'm gonna take Oh Hello. And I'm gonna put that. And going back in with a fluffy brush, we're just gonna blend those edges out so they're nice and soft. All right, moving on to the face for foundation. I'm going to wear my Maybelline Dream Urban, ah, Maybelline Dream Urban Cover Foundation. I really like this foundation. I don't know why I don't reach for it more. Probably because I don't wear foundation all that often. I don't, why did I put foundation on my forehead? Why? I know I don't like putting foundation on my forehead, yet I do it all the time. I just like, I just like doing that. I just like making myself upset. Is this too dark? That might actually be too light. I don't know when I got this much sun. I do know when I got this much sun. I have to take a walk. I take two walks at work every single day. I don't. I don't know who told them that was a good idea. It's great for my clients. I sweat and I worry about my wig coming off every single day. <laughs> every single day, that's my life. The coverage on this foundation is honestly to die for. It's so pretty on the skin i love it so much all right for concealer hmm. for concealer i'm gonna use the elf 16 hour camo concealer my foundation if my hair could just stay in its place that would be really lovely am i rushing i feel like i'm rushing i don't know why all of a sudden i felt like damn bitch slow down I feel like I'm rushing. I slow down, Aaron. I'm not. I'm not. 
I'm not rushing to go anywhere. I'm, I'm not, I don't know. Like I'm going somewhere, but I'm not, like I'm not running late. I don't know why I felt like I was rushing. I'm not, I don't know. gonna set under my eyes with surprise surprise the Fenty Beauty powder I promise I'm gonna try some new products soon I actually have like a full face of new makeup video that I'm gonna do soon I've just been trying to figure out what products I want to use cuz like I've been using all the same products in my videos, but it's just like that's realistic that's that's realistic and that ordinary foundation is getting retarded Hard. I was like, no, maybe I'll try it again, but like, I don't like it. And even the concealer, I'm like, I could like it, but what's the point? Like, I have concealers that I do like, so why would I reach for something I could like, that I might, in theory, like, eventually? No, just return it. Just return it. Someone else can like it. I don't want it. I'm going to take my Black Radiance True Complexion Contour Palette. Add a little color back into the face. so much hair on my face, it's so annoying. I, I definitely put way too much, way too much um, bronzer up there. <laughs> Give a little spritz of the NYX Bear with me. So you can add a little dew back into the face. So now let's go back into the eyes. Sometimes I do too much with my face and this is how I forget to put lashes on. Like I did an entire video one time and forgot to finish my eyes because I like went and finished my entire face. Normally I do foundation, concealer, go back to the eyes and I just forgot. I don't, I don't know. I don't know, like just now I was gonna finish the whole thing. And I was like, Aaron, you have so much pink eyeshadow on. What's wrong here? Something's missing. The rest of your eyes. Duh. Okay. Um. <laughs> Let's. So I'm gonna take Oh Hello. I'm going to use that to not rim the whole bottom of my waterline, but just like that outer part right here, right there, and just connect it. Before we add our lashes, I'm gonna go into our Anastasia Beverly Hills palette and I'm gonna take the black eyeshadow, but literally any black eyeshadow will be fine. And I'm just gonna um, line my, not my waterline, what's this called? The upper part <laughs> um, with black eyeshadow. And I'm just doing a very thin line. It's just to help hide the lash band. But I do flick it out a little bit at the end. For lashes, I'm going to take, these are from AliExpress, as most of my lashes are, I explain this all the time. But I'm going to take like really long, wispy lashes and apply these using my kiss lash glue that took me an unnecessary like an embarrass an embarrassingly an embarrassing an embarrassingly an embarrassingly a long amount of time to put my lashes on um and now i feel like they look too heavy I don't feel like they look heavy when I look at them in the mirror, but when I look up into the camera, I'm like, bitch, you, you look like your eyes are drooping. What is it, the camera has 10 pounds? They're adding five pounds to my eyes. I look good, but. 
Um, let me finish my, <laughs> everyone's like, I don't know bitch about that. Finish my eyes, okay. I want to add, I'm gonna go back into the Jaclyn Hill palette. By the way, I've been using the volume two palette. I don't think I ever said that. So if you were trying to follow along and wondering why you haven't been using the same colors, I've been using volume two. But I'm gonna take the color a moment I'm gonna put that into my inner corner. Period. All right, some Charlotte Tilbury spray to finish off. For lips, I'm going to use the Fenty Beauty Gloss Balm in Fussy. Surprise. Do I ever use anything with actual color? No, I do. I wear nudes, <laughs> like nude lipsticks occasionally. Not often though. All right, let's go get dressed. I gotta change these lashes, it's not working. No, I was really gonna walk away, but these lashes are not working. It's doing too much. Let me see, let me see what's like with the hair. It's giving. Is it giving? Or is it giving, bitch, what the fuck? It's not giving. No. Y'all was gonna let me walk out the house like this? No, no, wait. What could I do better? No, 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 Aaron. It's not okay, okay, okay. That's giving. Period. That's the one. This looks much better. It doesn't hit severely, but it looks much better. And don't look too close because the taking off and the reapplying of the glue definitely gunks up that black liner eyeshadow thing I, I did a little bit, but I'm just being honest with you just in case you were wondering. But now, we can go again. Anyway, for the outfit, we're keeping it very simple. This top is from Dee's. I think it came in a set with the skirt, which I would not wear it together. It looks kind of crazy. Jeans are from American Eagle. And then the heels are Steve Madden. And then my purse is from BB. And then my hair, I wouldn't probably wear my hair like this. Probably wear my hair like this. But we're just gonna, I was just wearing my hair like this so you could pretend that I'm wearing a strapless bra with the outfit. Just pretend. Um, <laughs> and then for jewelry, I didn't put any on because I'm home alone and I still haven't mastered um, putting jewelry on with nails. So I probably just wear like a simple necklace and small little hoops or studs with this outfit. But yes, that is it for my life.